All right, just gonna show the fact that Smoky Satanist doesn't like having his sin kicked. I did a video rebuking him. Let me just uh, pull it up. I did a video rebuking him uh, yesterday uh, with all the profanity he likes to use. And I'm just gonna pull that video up right now. Oops. Uh, I did two videos actually on him. Let me just get that pulled up. Okay, these two videos right here. Uh, Smoky Satanist talking like an atheist and Smoky Satanist and his filthy tongue uh, rebuked and reproved and uh, He actually commented on one of the videos. Let me see if I can pull that one up uh, And he's proving that he doesn't like having He doesn't like having his uh, a sin kicked uh, Where is it? There's the comment right there. So it says oh no the Puritan culture police and then I respond with you have the mouth of any lost Satanist, death metal, mock, death metal rock musician. In Ephesians, I quote Ephesians 4.29, Let no corrupt communication proceed out of your mouth, but that which is good to the use of edifying, that they may minister grace unto the hearers. In Colossians 2.8, uh, But now ye also put off the, all these anger, wrath, malice, blasphemy, filthy communication out of your mouth. So he's calling me the Puritan culture police. Why? Because this is what lost people do. This is what lost uh, unsaved sinners do when they get their sin kicked. You know, and of course he does this little live stream, this, this little hit piece live stream on me, uh, not too long ago, but about two hours ago or so, he did this little hit piece live stream on me. Uh, Smokey triggers another dumb kid. And at one point in the stream, he calls me a dumb autist. You see, this is what lost people do. This is what lost sinners do. When they can't, when they, when they get rebuked, when they have their sin kicked, they resort to personal attacks and character assassination, which you'll see in the stream. That's what he does. It's all personal attacks. He calls me a dumb autist, calls me all these names, uh, just profanity left and right. Why? Because he's a lost hellbound sinner and he doesn't like having his sin kicked. And by the way, you just watch any of his streams. I mean, his flesh, is, the, the sinful, I mean, of course, he doesn't have the Holy Spirit, but his sinful flesh is just taken over throughout the entire stream. All you see is bitterness, wrath, anger, malice. That's all you see. He's a contentious person as well. Okay. But of course, of course, the, the flesh is going to take over in its videos. Why? Because he doesn't have the Holy Spirit of God. Okay, He is of his father, the devil. Galatians chapter 5, verse 19, down to verse 21. Now the works of the flesh are manifest, which are these, adultery, fornication, uncleanness, lasciviousness, idolatry, witchcraft, hatred, variance, emulations, wrath, strife, seditions, heresies, envyings, murders, drunkenness, revilings, and such like. Of the which I tell you before, as so I, told, I also told you in time past, that they which do such things shall not inherit the kingdom of God. Okay, and if you don't know what the kingdom of God is, it's spiritual fellowship, according to Romans fourteen seventeen. But that's what happens. You see, he, he doesn't have the Holy Spirit of God, like I said before. He's a lost hellbound sinner. That is evident through his filthy profanity he likes using all the time. And just like any lost hellbound sinner, when they get their sin kicked, when they have their pride kicked, they resort to all kinds of personal attacks and character assassination. You know, personal attacks are not arguments. How about you actually deal with the scripture and actually deal with the point at hand? And of course, he tries to justify using profanity. You know, you see, this is the thing about all these these conditional security uh, Catholics because conditional security it comes from Roman Catholicism. They don't like it when you when you call it their own wickedness. And by the way, I'm not I'm not easy believism. Okay, don't try to accuse me of being easy believism. I'm against easy believism as well. You see, here's the thing: you have one side, the, the lordship, salvation, conditional security types. Then on the other side, you have the the easy believism, antinomian types. Both sides are false. Both sides are are heresy. Okay, the biblical uh, side, you could say, is the new birth after salvation. The Holy Ghost comes and cleans your life up. It's not to be saved. But it doesn't mean you have some kind of excuse to keep living in sin. Okay, here's a scripture I want to end off with: John chapter three, verse nineteen to twenty-one. And this is the condemnation that light is come into the world, and men love darkness rather than light, because their deeds were evil. Like a smoky Satanist right there. For everyone that doeth evil hateth the light, neither cometh to the light, lest his deeds should be reproved. But he that doeth truth cometh to the light, that his deeds may be made manifest, that they are wrought in God. Okay. Smoky Satanist does not like having his darkness revealed, does not like having his darkness reproved. And the devils in him are getting him all mad, hence why he'll, he'll, he'll use profanity, result to personal attacks and character assassination. Because since he doesn't have the Holy Spirit of God, all he can do is just act out of the lust of his sinful flesh. It's that simple. So yeah, uh, mark and avoid Smoky Satanist, he's a wicked devil. Be more stuff exposing this, this uh, Satanist in the future. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.